thing is that the moisture is moving away, almost completely gone already, while we're still relatively mild, especially in the areas where the rain's moving out, which is St. Clair and Macomb County. So it's just a little sliver that's moving away. We're in good shape. Mount Clemens 54, 50 in Port Huron right now, and 51 in Detroit. But Lapeer and Flint 33 or so, that hasn't changed. They've been between 32 and 34 now for several hours, but the west side of our area is kind of collapsing with the cold air moving in. So Ann Arbor's down to 41. 37 and Adrian even colder off to the west in Jackson and areas there. So that's that last little sliver moving out just south of Port Huron right now. Uh, you do see some green down here by Monroe. That is not radar. That is not rain. That is the flood warning that's still going for uh, the river raising at Monroe. It's uh, up to 12 feet now. Extra melt. A lot of it because of the warmer temperatures, a little bit of rain as well. So that's going to stay in this major flood category through the end of the week, into the weekend at least here. Flood category is way down here when you got to start worrying about things, and we're way above that. So be watchful there around the river because the ice jams may become more of an issue as we start to get colder again into and through the weekend. Cold air returns, but it's drier cold air. So again, we got that one buffery day, if you will, mostly cloudy, couple of flurries tomorrow. And then here comes Thursday late. This is 8 o'clock in the evening, so much of Thursday is dry. I think we'll actually start with a little bit of sunshine. And then in the evening hours, the snow starts coming over the border, moving in as this little system works its way by. It's not really a potent one, but it's going to give us some snow to deal with. Accumulating snow is likely this is 6 o'clock in the morning, and as it moves by, it starts to take the snow away slowly but surely through the day on Friday. So these are amounts by 8 o'clock in the morning on Friday. So this is Thursday night snow for the most part. Two to three inches widespread. This is our first look at snow totals. It's Tuesday night. We're looking at Friday morning. So if we have to adjust those, we will, of course. Uh, looks like the biggest deal in terms of the roads will be Friday morning commute here one way or another. And we're probably going to add another inch uh, likely on Friday to these totals here. So we'll keep you updated if things have to change. But the point is you're going to deal with more snow again on Friday, especially to get your day started. 26 overnight tonight in Detroit. Think about that. We've come off the mid 50s today, all the way down to 26. Lapeer 18, Howell 21, Pontiac 20. That's pretty cold stuff. And tomorrow we don't bounce back much. More 20s than 30s for highs, mostly cloudy, a couple of flurries. I hate to do this to you, but yeah, we're talking wind chills again tomorrow, mostly in the teens throughout the day. Around 30, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Looks like Saturday's a decent day, but that snow's coming through here Friday morning.